And only on Local 10, a break in the case after a deadly shooting at Gulfstream. A suspect is now in custody, so let's get right over to Local 10's Rosh Lowe. He is live in Hallandale Beach with the exclusive details on their arrest. Rosh. This case made a lot of news when it occurred back in April, April 3rd, where there was a murder outside of Strike 10, the boat. Bowling alley, you can't even go bowling, man. Um, hit the like button, subscribe, hit the PayPal Cash App Super Chat, support the damn channel. Let's go. Bowling alley at Gulfstream, and now we have breaking news. There's an arrest. Let's get right to our video here. I'll give you the information as it comes from Hollandale Beach Police. They have arrested Brianna Purcell in the homicide of Latour. Well, her name, yo. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Here's the thing, though. At least she got a real hair, man. Salute to the sister having a real hair, man. What does she have tattooed on her neck, Ock? What does that say? Almost Shanique like it says Shaniqua. It does look like it says Shaniqua. Shania or something, maybe? Sh 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 yeah, Shania. Yeah, Shania or some shit. I like her hair, though, man. You know when would you ever want to encounter this woman in real life and have her looking at you like that? Nah, never, Jack. <laughs> Yo, here's the I'm thing. Good. Here's the thing, though. I'm good. The phone call she could make, think about if, if she's like that, think about if she makes a phone call. Like, nah, they call man, her, man. The <laughs> <laughs> they call her. She comes and straightens it all out. <laughs> Yo. For real. Yeah, man, that's probably what happened. Hollandale Beach Police, they have arrested Brianna Purcell in the homicide of LaToya Arnold, also known as Legend Billions. As I mentioned, this murder took place on April 3rd, what? just north of the Kill, strike wait, what? She killed a rapper? Did she kill a rapper? That might be the uh, tranny's drag name. I wish to no longer speak on this matter. Legend Billings. Oh, so yeah, listen. <laughs> See, you know what? All that boxing, the, the men beating up the women during the boxing, man. See, I told you that shit wasn't no good, man. Now these women, as soon as they get into something with a transgender, they're like, not today, buddy. So we got to stop this. We gotta. It's really the IOC's fault. I blame the IOC for this, man. Bowling alley. And what we're getting from Hollandale Beach Police is that this incident actually stemmed from a fight that occurred a few days earlier in Miami Gardens. Now, Purcell, they tell me, is a convicted felon. She's actually in jail in Miami-Dade on an unrelated case that included robbery charge. Damn, she's in prison for an un in jail for an unrelated. Yo, she, she, this wasn't the only thing she did recently. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> This was just, this Not is, Brianna. think about it, man. <laughs> just think about it, man. Like, yo, man, they active, man. Like, now it, it puts that, that, that traffic stop into a, a better light now. Because it's like, yo, like, they they just, that these, their days are different than our days. <laughs> you know what What goes on in the course of 24 hours? Like, they're, like, living out here. They're out here living, like, the movie Friday or Ferris Bueller. Every day is, like, Ferris Bueller's day off. If only it was, like, Ferris Bueller. <laughs> meets boys in the hood. Ferris Bueller meets Minister Society. It's, like, yeah, every black woman's day. Every is that, day. Is that a black privilege? I... I <laughs> is it Maybe. To some degree it is, man. To just be able to live life like that. To where, like, every day is just so much going on. Stemmed from a fight that occurred a few days earlier in Miami Gardens. Now, Purcell, they tell me, is a convicted felon. She's actually in jail in Miami-Dade on an unrelated case that included robbery charges. And now she's going to be charged in this case. I want to bring in Captain Megan Jones. This is just breaking this noon. Tell me the importance of this arrest, Megan. It's uh, very important for the community to know that we again have made an arrest in this case to uh, bring justice to the victim and her family. Um, taking this person off the streets has made it safer 
And our detectives, we want to thank our detectives for the hard work that they've done this whole entire time, as well as the people who called in and gave us tips. This is important to mention. You tell me this is an ongoing investigation. You're looking for other subjects right now, right? There may be additional subjects uh, that we are looking for at this time. So if anyone still has information, we are looking for any additional information. Initially, when this occurred, there were concerns that this was a hate crime. Can you give us an update on that? We have not considered this a hate crime. Uh, both Stop. individuals in this case are a part of the LGBTQ plus uh, community. Therefore, yeah, we know. Uh, the likelihood of this event transpiring to further impact the community, we do not perceive. Line. Bottom line here, though, is you're urging the public to come forward with even more information, but you've made an arrest in this case. Correct. We have made an arrest in the homicide, and we want anybody who has is any information to please come forward. It may be big or small, you know, but it can impact the, the community. Yeah, I mean, continuing yeah. investigation on this case. Thank you, Captain. That's the very latest here in Hollandale Beach. Once again, the headline this noon, an arrest made in the shooting that got a lot of attention because it did happen at Gulfstream. There were a lot of concerns. And add to that, Hollandale Beach police believe there are other subjects out there. They need your help. We're getting all this information right now. We'll bring you more information later today. For now, I'm live in Hollandale Beach. Rosh Lowe, Local 10 News. Okay, Rosh, we'll talk to you later this afternoon. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Not a hate crime, just regular true non true violence. So it's working. Crime is down, and here's a success story for the police and all of us. They got a suspect. Wow. wow. Crime is down. This is, the, this, is the Kam, this is the Kamala effect. This is the Kamala effect. It's creating a crime is just going down all over the country because of her. Yeah. I mean, as soon as she... Yeah, exactly. The joy. It's, it's the joy. It's the joy, man. Feel the joy. <laughs> they got the shooter. They bring, they bring the, the joy back. Joy, joy is 1% less grape. <laughs>